what's up guys <laughs> back again with another video this time it's on another BB gun one of the old school bad boys right here now, this one here I know everybody should remember this one this is the old school red rider now this is definitely an old one as you can see it's one my granddaddy used to have back in the days check it out So you guys can get a better view on this one ain't even the best condition that's one of the original ones got the wooden stock you can see that the, the, some of the, it's even war from back in the days you can see that now I have a newer version of this gun right here and um it looks way better than this <laughs> But I wanted to kind of keep it original, so I bought this one out because um, show you guys what a real pure old school red rider looked like. Get a closer view. You can see where it's even busted up here. So the stock screw come out right here. Just throw another screw in it. See that? But I left it like this sort of look beat up from the 80s, you know, right here. That size is stock screw is slack. But, uh, this thing doesn't even shoot, I don't think. It's just like a piece to have, you know? <laughs> Alright, so you just, how you work it, those of you who haven't really had too much dealing with a Red Rider BB gun, um, I think you used to load this thing up. Then you load this thing up down here. I think this way it go at the bar. It's been a while since I ain't operated it. Mm, used to be a lot of them in here. It's been a while, but I know you load it. You 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 uh click this thing like this right here. And once you click this back, like I said, this thing old and crusty. You kick this back, you kick that handle back like that. Boom, it's ready to shoot. I think these work by spring, yeah, spring action. When you once you spring this right here back and pull it back down, like that, boom, and she ready to shoot. Simple as that. And I told my buddy, uh, Mark's review, that I want to do this. So, Mark, are you watching this for you, man? Here's the Red Rider. Now, mine's is beat up, but. It's still in the house. <laughs> yup. Yeah, it's beat up, but it's in the flesh, though. You see it? This is definitely one from the 80s. Let's bend it slow so you guys can see it. I'm going to turn it around. So you guys can get a look at the bottom head. Classics here, boy. One of the all time BB guns, man. This is it. Red Rider. So I'm doing a short little review on it for you guys. Nothing special, man. It's just be doing a little something, something. Y'all know how we do. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys got a good look at it. Uh, you can get a new style Red Rider now from like Walmart for like. I want to say at least about 30 some bucks, give or take. I'm not sure, you know. It's been a while since I even really shot one of these. It's been a minute now. And maybe I got to get back on it, though. Just do a little target practicing with them for you guys. How about that, man? That'd be cool, wouldn't it? <laughs> Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this one. Get another view in on the Daisy Red Rider. This is definitely a vintage one, as you can see. It's been around a long time. That's why I picked this one. I got another one that looked ten times better than this, guys. But this one here, I want to give you the vintage one from back in the days, from the 80s. This one, I think, this one was bought like in probably about 82, 83. 
I'm like that, see that? You can tell by how beat up it is. It's definitely been around a long time. See that? Probably round shucks. I was a baby myself when this one was looking good. <laughs> looking good. I was a baby. So, you know, I'm going to tell you this thing probably made like 81, 82. Something like that. I was not but a newborn. Probably. It was one or two years old, luckily. See? That's the trigger right here. Trigger. You can tell this thing is super old, man. Might have came out in the late 70s. And I wasn't even born then. See? So, I don't know. But, this is the true Red Rider. Alright, guys. I want to share that with you guys. Uh, if, you, if you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know, man. And, um, yeah. Those of you new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Share my video with your family and friends. And, um, y'all want to see more stuff like that? Comment below, man. Let me know what's good. And uh, I'll come back with some more stuff like that, man. Uh, I love to collect pellet guns and real guns, too. So I got a lot of real ones and I got a lot of pellet guns. Got some 38, 357, 9s, 380s, 8Ks, M4s, 12 gauge. I got them all now. I got a little bit of everything going on. All right. So guys, once again, new to my channel, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Share my videos with family and friends. Take care, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace!